We're going to take the chicken of the land, which is chicken, and try to catch the chicken of the sea, which is, uh, well, it's a crap for the sake of this video right now. Typically in your crab pot, you got a little slot like this where you can uh, put some stuff in there. And we're just gonna drop some chickens, some chunkums, right in there, all right? We're good, we got our bait in there. And we're just gonna drop her in. Let it down. Now we can just leave it. We can leave it for, I mean, we can leave it overnight pretty much. And uh, come back and hopefully it's full of crabs. All right, y'all, we're out here. We got our boy, Alan. He's trying to get some bait right now. We're looking for big, big mullet, those big like, six eight plus inch mullet that's going to be some pretty good shark bait if we can get some of that we want the big baits for the big sharks big stinky fresh bloody bait so that's what we're going after that is the first step to catching sharks need a something something to hammer this sucker in. Hey, wait, Siege. Well, not having a mallet makes this slightly more difficult. I think it's good just to use these Sputniks. They just don't roll at all. So this is the guy that let us borrow his uh, his setups, Ian. Yep. Thank you so much again, yeah, man. No we really appreciate that. Hopefully we can get one in for you. We're gonna go try to fish and just pull some other like live bait up that's more ideal and get it on that rod and uh, kind of have two different setups going on. There's fish all over the place, dude. Hopefully you get like a nice croaker or something on that you can just cool. face hook. And... Yeah, I have a feeling that the squid sits out there and marinates long enough, something's gonna get on there. Oh, Dang nice. That's Dang perfect. Way. That'll work. Nice. Yeah, it looked like a fin. Yeah, cut that in half. Yeah. Cut cut the wing off. No, just cut it straight in half. All right. I'm gonna chop this guy up. You gotta make sure you get rid of this. You either gotta bury it really deep, catch any or waves out there. better yet, just throw it find a trash can and throw it away. Yeah, if someone nice steps on that, there, it? it's gonna nice hurt pretty bad. Oh yeah. Bait, baby. Let's go. That's some good bait. We're gonna get this half. I guess maybe this half with the tail on that guy and this half on this guy over here. There it goes. That's through the barb. That's that's not going anywhere. That thing's on there. By far the biggest bait I've ever used to catch a fish. I mean you're talking that like an eight aught giant just steel hook and a chunk of bait that's bigger than a lot of the fish we catch. <laughs> so pretty exciting. Go time, baby. Yeah. 
Godspeed, Levi. I'm trying to make sure that that uh, line's not moving when I pull this. Because it went off to the left, or to the right a pretty good ways. Set the drag. It's pretty good right there. We're good, now we wait. All right, bait catching round two. We're gonna see if we can get some more fresh bait. Maybe some live bait, that, that might be really good. We're gonna fish into the night if we have to. We need to bring a shark up. Black knocked into your Oh my God, dude, what is this? This is a big stingray, I think, y'all. Cause it's a, uh, it's barely, it's barely moving. We need to get him in the wash so we can pull him in. It's a big ray. And oh, that's what it feels like. A ray? Yeah. Yeah, he's foul hooked. He's in he's hooked in the back. That's why that's why he looked big or that's why he felt so big. This is a fat bait. All right, I'm gonna reel in this guy. All right, we're about to cut chop him up. Yeah, we're gonna cut him in half. Right about there. Probably cut him in quarters, honestly. Our boy Ian's had maybe maybe one too many trulies, maybe five, maybe ten. So he's uh, <laughs> we're we're not letting him out on the kayak right now. Yo, let me paddle it out. No, we're gonna let Steven paddle it out. Steve, I'm gonna get her out. Alright boys, yeah, we've definitely got one interested. I'm loosening the drag all the way up and just letting him run if he hits it again. He might be dropping the bait because he's he's getting line shot. There he goes, there he goes, there he goes, there he goes. Yo! Hey! Hey! We're not sure how big this thing is. He might be small. So I'm gonna let him run a good bit. And now we're gonna tighten up. And set, lean into him. Yep, he's on, baby, he's on. Yeah, he's on, he's on. It's not a giant, but it's, he's definitely on. Let's go, baby, let's go. That was a big bait out there, so. <laughs> it's at least got some size. There's a little bit. There's a little bit of tug. Oh yeah, I see him. He just showed up in the wave. Yeah. All right, he's coming in, y'all. All right. Perfect set. Perfect yeah, perfect. Hook perfect. Set. That was that back hook too. It was? That was that lighter hook, yeah. Yeah. Yep. So I got pliers on mine. Yeah, go ahead and grab it. Uh, I got, got them. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Bro, look at that. Look at that fish, y'all. That is so sick. Our first time shark fishing, y'all. We waited a while, honestly. We waited a hot minute for this guy, but we finally got one in. And you know, not really even a big one, but still like freaking awesome. That was so exciting. We're gonna let this guy go. We wanna respect the animal and get him back nice and safe and sound. What an amazing creature. Nice black tip shark, about a three and a half footer. Our first shark, our first time shark fishing. How freaking awesome is that, baby? That is sick. There he goes right there. 
<laughs> Let's go. go dude. Yeah, look at that, y'all. He was just straight munching on it. I mean, that was a that was a whole connected piece of ray when we put it out there. And now it's just like, it's in half. I mean, he, he chomped it in half. I think that double hook rig is the move. Again, big shout out to Ian, who let us borrow this stuff. We wouldn't have been able to do it without him. I think we're gonna wrap it up right here, guys. We are always going on adventures. We're always exploring, trying to catch new fish. If you guys love to see high quality fishing videos, consider giving us a subscribe. Definitely like this video, share it out. And uh, just comment down below, y'all. We love interacting with y'all. That is all I got, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, all it takes is one, baby. Slab out.